Hello my friends and thank you for coming back and watching another video. Before we get into this video, give this video a big thumbs up. Like, subscribe, comment, and share. Hit that notification bell. Select all and make sure your notification bell is on. You don't know what video I'm, I'm coming with. A recipe video, a great tips video, a family video, a food review. You don't know, so you don't want to miss out, okay? So today, I'm going to give you another recipe. This is my fried pork chop recipes. I have quite a few, but this one my family loves, absolutely love, okay? It's real easy. Um, I'm going to show you the ingredients, and I'm going to show you what I put on there, okay? And I want you to make it and tell me what you think about it. So right here, I have my pork chops, my center cut pork chops, all clinked off, okay? So right here, I'm going to add my seasoned salt. So we got seasoned salt. Then I am going to add my garlic powder. And then I am going to add my um, lemon pepper seasoning. And then I am going to add my garlic and herb seasoning right here. Give you a close up of it. This is made with black pepper and sea salt. And I am just going to mix that around. Okay. You, I showed you many videos of me mixing my uh, food around. Um, so I'm going to mix that around. And I'm going to put that on a deep, fr uh, deep fryer. But right here you need to get you a... Um, a thermometer because when you fry in make sure that the temperature is up to 300 That's the best way to fry your chicken your fish your pork chops Make sure that grease is on the temperature of 300 so get one of these. Okay, it's very important And then after I season it all up. I am going to add Andy's chicken seasoning Okay, Andy's chicken seasoning. I showed you um, this before. It's really delicious on fried chicken. And I also put this on fish, okay? Fish too. And it comes out delicious, okay? So I'm going to add this on, um, this braiding on to my pork chops. And it comes out so, so good, okay? Don't think it's not, don't think like, oh, it's, it's say chicken seasoning. But this seasoning, you could put it on mostly anything, okay? This seasoning is really, really delicious, okay? So I'm going to fry these up in my um, deep fryer for about eight minutes. And I want them to be on a temperature of 145 to 150 when I take them out, okay? And once I do that, I'm going to do a short video and I'm going to show you. Oh, and this yellow rice I'm also making, this Vigo yellow rice is so delicious. It's like $2 and some change that you could go pick up um, at your local grocery store. It's really simple, easy to make, and it's really delicious and creamy, okay? You make it the right way, it comes out delicious. So this is my, um, my recipe for my pork chops. I'm going to show you again. You have your seasoning, um, your seasoned salt. You have your garlic powder, you have your herb and garlic, and you have your lemon pepper. And don't forget your chicken seasoning that you're going to add on to the end. Make sure your grease is on the temperature of 300, pork chops on um, 145 to 150, and they going to come out delicious, and it already smells delicious. I told you this um, recipe was simple, easy, and, um, you know, anybody can make it okay so go ahead and follow these directions i'm sure you're gonna love it leave it down in the comment section let me know what you think i'm gonna do a short video once everything is complete to show you how it comes out so go be um look out for that video okay i appreciate everyone for supporting this channel don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up show you how it looks and it's going to come out so delicious follow these um this recipe and you will love it i'll talk to everyone soon and look out for my short video everyone talk to you soon